Question 1038. Do you think a TV show that airs at a specific time, meaning the majority of the audience watches each episode at the same time, adds to the social experience surrounding it? What? That is way too many words for a question. <laughs> You should have seen how long it was originally. It's better because you spent 10 years putting it in along with everyone else. I didn't get it because I watched it in three months. That's what they're trying to say. It's also that you talk about it. It's it's also the hot topic. You're excited for the next episode coming up. Or and... you're pissed about the last season and, and, and talk about how fucking TV <laughs> and David fucking it up and fuck those guys so fucking hard. Sorry. <laughs> I don't have problems with it. <laughs> uh, Nerdy says, yes, it does add. So would you prefer to... to do, do you prefer the binge on your own or, or the shared experience over time? I mean... Well, that's a different question. Back, like, say, like, The Sopranos, okay? I mean, we didn't have... It ended in, I think, 2008, 2007. So we didn't have, like, the social media that we have today, but it was spoken about, especially the ending. And that was very interesting to, to jump into that dialogue because it was ambiguous and everybody had their own theories. So, yeah, I'd say yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's interesting to watch now when j just the difference in how Doctor Who is perceived. Mm. Uh, as the as information is released about it, this slow in, in, in drip feeding of information that you can discuss, that you you can build entire relationships on theorizing what's going to happen, that you can't get when you 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 have it every, everyone watching in, at different stages at different. I don't know. Uh, Brainbug says I agree that it increases the experience. Micro Raptor, it worked for Game of Thrones. God, the scammer says Game of Thrones. Chad says, yes, the big change today is kids don't have common stories to share. Groups are harder to form and harder to break. Nerdy says, I always binge. That explains your answer to the last question. Uh, Serif says, I don't watch much TV. Been meaning to look into Game of Thrones, though, since people keep bringing it up. See, I don't see the point in watching Game of Thrones now. It's calm, it's gone. And no! Like how it ends, so. Fuck <laughs> you, Dave. What? Fuck you. Fuck you. Uh, Starkey says, probably, which is why I typically wait for all seasons to come out and then watch them to avoid the social aspect. See, I do that mostly because I'm impatient and don't want to wait for the next seat, next next things to come. I don't know. Jenny? Um, I, I think it probably does. I don't have any personal experience with it because I just am not into television stuff so much that I <sighs> have to... Cheers. Watch every every show and then discuss it with people. I mean, there are certainly shows that I felt compelled to see every episode and and fell in love with certain characters and that sort of thing. But I just don't necessarily talk to other people about it. But yeah. I've certainly seen other people jump um, in it. That's for sure. Oh, sorry, 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 guys. But it, it happens to be somebody in the household's birthday, and so. There happened to be some Bollinger on the go, so I thought I'd better get in there. Your but, um, not mine, no. Um, somebody in the household is celebrating one, so... Go on, what's your answer? Ah, uh, right. <laughs> TV... Um, I've, I've generally tended to binge watch... Show, but I, I've been one of those that I've... I've never necessarily always got into the show that everybody's talking about. Like... I mean, I was pretty late into Game of Thrones. Um, <laughs> I haven't seen a single minute. Un un unfortunately, <laughs> to the point. Unfortunately, to the point where people fucking spoiled it. Um. Um. So it kind of got a little bit. Of why am I bothering to continue watching this when I fucking know what happens? Mm. Um. But no, I I've tended to. I mean, sometimes I suppose when it's like if you if it's like a thing that there's that little kind of culty thing that um it's your own secret little thing kind of thing you know like like the wire you know um which is the one i sorry something everyone went quiet then no, sorry, um, the background yeah. noise from jenny right, went away yeah. okay but like like the, like the wire which is my absolute all-time favorite show ever 
but it was never like a really big rating show. It sort of got popular, weirdly kind of got popular only when it was like hot, released on hot DVD and stuff, really. But um, hmm. but no, I, I no, I, I don't. I mean, no, I've never really indulged in the whole like water cooler talk or whatever about a TV show. Um, that but then, that but then again, much in your profession. Hmm. Sadly, 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 sad. I mean, it did a bit with Game of Thrones. I just try to ignore it a lot of the time. No, I was like I said, I was a bit late into Game of Thrones. Um, uh, sadly, the last one that I heard any water cooler talk is a show that I will swear I will never watch, and it was fucking Love Island. So, <laughs> which is something I have no intention of watching because it sounds like the it, it sounds like the absolute um, why we're fucked up as a species kind of show <laughs> math pig i generally binge now but i do enjoy i did enjoy the experience of watching it every week not that i ever watched anything that a lot of people watched but uh with a small group of friends that i had it was nice to to chat and uh expect and speculate on what's coming next week mm. That being said, I have, I have, I have indulged in some of the speculation on season three of Cobra Kai when it finally comes out. So, uh, what's Cobra Kai? That's it. Don't, that's, don't that's, worry, that's, Dave. that's a fucking brilliant series. But, but I would have to say, you would have had to have a bit of nostalgia for the Karate Kid films to really enjoy that. So, it's better than film. Sorry, better than I film, didn't want to answer anyway, Dave. Did I'm feeling like you, Manda. <laughs> <laughs> I thought well, you're, 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 you're only here for the smutty questions. Go on, Sammy. What do you think? Doesn't matter, Dave. <laughs> yes, it no, does. It's not a smutty question, so don't worry <laughs> what I think. I actually had a fucking intellectual answer worked out. Go on, then. Fuck you. <laughs> Give me no. your answer. Intellectual's not the right fucking word. <laughs> I just had an answer. What's your but answer? Anyway, let me just double check the question again. <laughs> Very much, oh, yeah. Um, well, yes, of course it fucking adds to it. But no, I don't like people, so I don't like to... I just want to binge watch the shit. I don't care what anyone else fucking thinks about it. Oh, okay, I have a slightly off-topic question. Does it how, matter? Much t- how much TV did you get in the JWs? Whatever Mum was watching. Did she watch which soaps? Was shit. Yeah, soaps and shit like I don't know, Lost and fucking. You you don't like Lost? Lost was awesome. Yeah. Dave. The ending of the last the last season, season of Lost was, was terrible. The ending of Lost. <laughs> Fuck a dick, though. Yes. Well, I thought that I thought the whole like I didn't even get to the end, so I thought the start was fucking shit. Can we assume that? Can we assume that you won't be joining Manda on TV time to talk about Lost then, Sammy? (laughs) Well, the the seasons I watched, yes. Sammy, you got to pick a show. I want you to come on drunk. (laughs) <laughs> uh, Micro Raptor says isn't Love Island one of those shows where boring people have sex with each other if I want to watch Pre- sex I've got websites for that yeah pretty much it's pretty much it's um, you know like it's, it's the people who haven't discovered Pornhub pretty much mm. it's, it, I've never understood porn with a story like <laughs> Have you have you never enjoyed erotic literature? It's frustrating. <laughs> frustrating. Too slow. <laughs> I have a very short attention span. <laughs> I think I've discovered recently I have AD. <laughs> Possibly autism. Both. No, I don't believe that for a second. <laughs> Just an asshole. It's fine. So are we all? <laughs> Right. <laughs> Answer it, Dave. Uh, what was the ah! What was the question? The question oh, I, was. I, I think it's implied uh, in the question. Something about everyone watching it at the same time. 
I think it was answered in the question. Um, right. <laughs> then why did you ask it? For fuck's sake, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> to see what you people th thought. You normally have better answers to these things than I do. Oh, fuck off. So, right. what's your, so what is your answer then, Dave? My answer is that I think it adds to the, to the social experience. That doesn't change okay. the fact that I much prefer to binge watch things. Yeah. So okay. I, I think... I know. The problem is, I think if I was able to work, and I could and I could use it to waste an hour of, 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 of work chatting to people about it, I think I'd enjoy it more. Yeah, I, I just think probably it's because um, most of... There's, there's very few times where the people that I work with that I'm into the same sort of things that they'll watch. Uh, there are exceptions, but generally... See, that's good that the issue. To have it as a social yeah. experience, you've got to have a, a social group that does it. Yeah. I mean, the worst thing is, is I don't find the online communities anywhere near as good. Because they put too much thought into it. When I want to bitch about a show, I don't want deep thoughts about it. I, I just want to, I just want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> if you enjoyed that, please hit the thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down. If you think you've got a better answer or just want to tell us how wrong we are, leave a comment down below. Subscribe down here for new questions every day and make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss out on our live shows. If you click over here, you'll see our latest upload. Over here for what YouTube thinks you'll love the most. And finally, for a complete playlist of all our currently released questions, click here.